we're going to find the mass of a one-dimensional object, and this is given a density function right here. Uh, this letter right here looks like a P, but it's actually a row. Hopefully I spell that right. It's a row, it's a Greek letter. And our wire is four feet long, starting at uh, zero and going to four. Right there. All right, we could graph this out. It's a parabola. Uh, the x-intercepts are zero and something. Oof. Negative five, so. Anyways, whatever this looks like. Uh, we need to, it's a happy parabola. So it's gonna look something like this. All right, all we need to do is figure out this area. The area is equal to uh, the mass when the height is the density function. So we have our mass is equal to uh, the integral a to b, rho x dx. So for us, this goes 0 to 4. Be careful, they don't always start at 0. Uh, a lot of them will, but not all of them. And we got x squared plus 5x dx. And then antiderivative, and then plug in your endpoints, and you'll have your mass.